Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of the fucking bell is fucking ringing, asshole! I've been recording all day, so I'm kind of exhausted at this point. So, you know who the hell did not left? Well then, Alicia, the Knights haven't found where the extremists are hiding, have they? No, the military buffer zone is quite large. But we doubt they're near Lasting Bell. That area has been thoroughly investigated. Then the next most likely candidate would be Glavend Basin. Yeah, they certainly weren't at Felquin Hillside. Hmm. Something wrong? There's a hidden spot in Glavin Basin that was sealed off by Edna. Not liking this. Let's check it out. Gotcha. So Miklio and Zavid are not with you. Yeah, they can't be here. They're off looking for something. I see. A pity. Huh? You're not gonna ask why? Actually, I like the idea of traveling with just us girls. <laughs> Quite so. Truthfully, I've always wanted to try a slumbering party. Slumbering party? <laughs> it's a slumber party! Slumbering <laughs> party. An unassuming name for such a grueling ascetic movement. Huh? Together, as a group, you endure a strict regimen of fasting and curbing of material desires while refining your communication, language, and data processing skills. If you don't bring up every last bit of your operation <laughs> I love this expertise, you can easily be ground into dust. It's not for the faint of heart. Edna! My goodness, it's not at all what I imagined. And at the end of this ordeal, a battle with the dreaded beast, Pillow. Monsters, even! The slumbering party! I had no idea it signified such a daunting endeavor! <clears throat> That's right. It's not to be undertaken lightly. <laughs> Edna's just teasing Alicia here, right? That is my hope. Is there skits when I go to sleep? Hold on. I have to go back, hold on. She really is quick to conform to her surroundings. Do you think her usual speech patterns reflect Maltran's influence? I wouldn't be surprised if she's reinvented herself every time she meets someone new. True. Nevertheless, her princess self, her knight self, her regular girl self, every one of these is the true Alicia. I wonder if she'll ever realize that. I'm sure she'll be okay. Well, Rose seems to think otherwise. Does she really? Would she have chosen to accompany Alicia if that were so? Well, whatever. At least life's not boring for once. Let's watch over them both. Yeah! Okay, good. Thank God, this is just one fucking thing. Thank fucking God! Uh, you know, let's change her clothes on. No. There we go. Let's go. I wonder if I can go down on the opposite end. I've always established this, that I just go to the root of Runs like a... No, if we can't. I should just check the map. God damn it! I'm a fucking idiot!
Okay, so we're going to Basin again. And I think it's Simone and the, the Creepier guy, I believe. Wow, there is no one. There's no fucking enemies here. That's fucking sad. Oh, I'll pick up that. Man, they could be a lot of save points, even though I haven't really done anything. Like, what the f- <laughs> Search rooms. Okay. Is everyone done? Done. Go. Ready? Fire. Ready? Fire. Ready? Fire. Ready? Fire. Ready? Music stuff, and it's not like uh, music when we fly against our dragon. A black panther? I just still can't armor size, so. Well done, everyone. But yeah, we're pretty much, this is pretty much the end game stuff now. He just got black fish. Knife handling. Do you have anything? I'm not hiding anything. I swear. I got just got fucking black bitch. Brat. Now we follow him, right? Hey, Rose. That is something that I don't fucking need. I guess this area. Why are you following me, jackass? Hey, turtles. Oh, I can do fucking that too? Nice. I don't have the money for it.
I have to walk like this. So it was here after all. We were right to be worried. Was there always a cave here? This cave leads to the village of Camlon. Camlon? The origin village? Yep. This is the entrance from the Roland side. The path had long been lost, but in the aftershocks of the cataclysmic battle with the Lord of Calamity, the way opened up once more. Yeah, but I sealed it. I know I did. Hmm. Let's go! Rose, wait! Even if we were to purify their malevolence, the fundamental problem won't be solved until they're properly apprehended. Let's report to Sergei and... There's no time for that! Listen to me! We can't allow any humans to set foot in here! Fine, let's go. What? I thought you were gonna put up more of a struggle. You wouldn't have backed down, would you? Well, that's true. Let's go. Okay. I can't tell if they really get along or not. Yeah, they do. <laughs> I wonder, hold on. We're almost done with this fucking story mode. To be perfectly honest with you. So let's go down here. You know what? I don't have time for your fucking shenanigans, bitch. Not like you guys can beat me up anyway. I'm like level now. Well, you guys. I don't mind killing you guys because you guys are fucking weak as hell. What the hell did you guys come from, asshole? I mean, I used to be pretty You guys got nothing on my skills, bitch! Oh, there's a chest just there. Nice! The Ribbon of Cosmos. Ah! Uh, ah, yeah, fuck it. What do we got to lose? I mean, it's not like these enemies can fuck us up anyway. We're like level 99! These guys are like level 56 for Pete's sakes. It's worse than I thought. Yes. The Malevolence is already producing very powerful Helgens. I don't know, Sorry. we just... Yep, she's mad. Can't say I blame her. Indeed. We went to the trouble of sealing this cave off. And now someone's reopened it. There's something in Camlon that has to do with Saray, isn't there? Oops, she noticed. <sighs> what? Let's take care of this quickly. I'm not gonna tell you. I'm not asking you to. Come on, go, bitch! Fine! You're gonna get That's what happens. Three fucking.
My will shall pierce thee. My will shall pierce thee. Fucking bullshit! Alright, I made it! Oh, that's what we're supposed to do. Oh, wait. I just went to my turn coming over here! <laughs> Son of a bitch! Uh, well, at least there's something here. A Roseberry Moose. Raspberry Moose, sorry, is that wrong? A Life Bottle, nice. Oh, we found an Elixir, nice. I can get rid of that. Going over here. I don't want to deal with that fucker. You know he's falling the fuck out of me. He's still fucking following me. Be on your Because this is a bad bitch! Gonna gravel and apologize. I have no time to deal with jackasses. Lily, I don't. Oh, you son of a bitch! <sighs> this area makes no fucking sense! I don't need a life bottle. I might go pee as fuck right now. Here so, I don't sense any more humans. Still, it's strange. Quite. Even if we allow for the corruption of extremists, one wouldn't expect all of them to become Hellions, or for this area to have such concentrated malevolence. Also, when I seal something, it doesn't just pop open again. Trust me. Let's move on. Okay, so at least I don't have to deal with fucking enemies anymore. Thank fucking God! Let's see what the hell we're missing over here. I could fight enemies, but you guys are here for the fucking story. Not me fighting constant enemies for no, no shits in their giggles. You know there's nothing to talk about when you just walk in a straight fucking line! Can't wait to be done with this fucking game. This playthrough has been draining on me. What's going on? Huh, 
so little Miss Wrecked in the Head is here. Alicia, watch out! I wanna go this way first off. See if there's anything over here? Probably not. Oh, there is. Something that I don't fucking need, you fucking dipshits. Yeah, Alicia never meets Dezel. Dezel, Dezel, Dezel never talks to Alicia. Which I find that odd, to be honest with you. That's the only character that does not... The only Seraphim that does not talk to Alicia that's in your party. Because remember, when Dezel dies, you can... I like it how it's all black and white. Alright, let's go this way. Fuck us! Are we done with this fucking maze? No, of course not. That would be too fucking easy! Nothing over here, so that takes that cake. I'm getting bored here. Literally, this is getting fucking boring as shit. Just trying to open up every chest, man. Ooh, that we can get rid of. Give to the fucking Lord of the Land. There you go. I feel like I just wasted my time coming over here. Still see a teacher when you look at me, dull girl. Simone, what are you doing? Now, Alicia Dipta, let me see you struggle. Alicia, look out! You're awful. <clears throat> Want me to do this? N no, I'll take this one. I... I have to. No one will blame you if you can't. You sure? Yes! Man... Oh good, we have to first start. She got weaker the last time we first started. She got her... <laughs> Can she use the as her second? No, she only has that one. He's still tough as nails, man. Any unpleasant truths you merely reject. The emotion-stunted impulse of a callow youth. That may be true, 
but I've made up my mind. Have you now? And stay down. I switch characters. You've noticed I'm an illusion, haven't you? What I see before me is reality and truth. Is that not what you taught me, Lady Maltrain? So you still cling to my words. There is no greater proof of your immaturity. This I know. Are you simply a fool then? No. Watch and see. You fucking dead bitch! I love doing this shit, man! Man, you can easily guess. You think I can't do the same shit, bitch? Fucking dies, you fucking bitch! <laughs> I'm not letting you purify me. What truly needs purification is this entire world! It's the same thing all over again. The real Maltran wound up killing herself, right? Yeah, and with Alicia's lance. Looks like Awful Girl plans to reenact the whole blessed thing. Should we intervene? No. Lady Maltran. So you stay your hand and sympathize with your enemy. Soft to the core. Of all your flaws, that might be... What you hate about me the most. Isn't that right? Meltran. Farewell. Aha. Uh -huh. So it was an opportunity to make a clean break with her past. You are such a doof. Why? Simone. Why do you smile? Who are you? This is Simone, a seraph with the power to create illusions. Everything just now was the work of Creep Girl here. It was her? Why do you smile when I tear open your wounds? How do you endure? Thank you. Huh? Oh For shit. allowing me a chance to right my mistakes. Character development! I'm truly grateful. Thanks to you, I can step forward with a clear mind and no regrets. <laughs> wow. That's our Alicia. Simone! I see now what great potential our world has lost. Here and tell us what you know. Dear girl, you too carry a heavy burden. 
this was mere prologue, will it be tragedy or comedy, I wonder? What's her damage? I think Simone may be questioning her place in the world. You can tell that she's trying to make a reassessment. Of Alicia? And you. I imagine she's quite concerned. Concerned about those who walked with Saray, which path we will take, which beliefs will guide us. With Saray. Whoa, malevolence! Well, haven't you tortured her enough? Rose? Alicia! How about a trip? Huh? To where Saray is. What? Huh? You don't want to? No, I, I do. But why now? You coming? Yes, of course I am. Cool. Let's get moving. Whoa, wait up! Why did you suddenly change your mind? <laughs> I'm not sure I follow. I mean, you're ratter than I thought. Ratter? I'm a rat? What? Oh, you just told me the a promise rat. has been kept. No, no. no. <laughs> rat. One fate leads to another, and on and on. Such is the way of this transient world. You and I are but jesters. Madly dancing through destiny's tangle. But know that this may be the last time our paths intersect. <laughs> I see how it is. I see very well. Why is this guy still alive? I thought we killed him! Have burdens. The girl and her sniveling companions still place hope in the shepherd rat. Fate, eh? <laughs> Makes me sick. This guy's still alive. <laughs> this guy's got some fucking anger issues. Bro. Stop laughing like a fucking creepo, asshole! Learn Azurus? Is that a new art? Oh, now she can use it now. Oh, thanks, game! Fuckers. How do you use this thing? A full hair combo. This guy can be Peace of the Heavens. Uh, next page. Oh, I have to have a five thing. Okay. Let's try to find a save point. That's Simone chick back there. She used to work under the Lord of Calamity. What? Isn't she a Seraph? She is. But it was not people or Seraphim who saw the true worth of her power, but the Lord of Calamity himself. So she clung to him. He was the only entity she knew who valued her and her abilities. And then Saray and I tore that from her. I sense a commonality between her and me somehow. Which part? Your stubbornness? Your stubbornness? Or your stubbornness. Yeah! Maybe your stubbornness then. Edna, you <laughs> Or your stub stub stubborn stub stub stubbornness. It's okay to keep quiet when you can't think of anything you know. Ouch! Stop burn! Oh my god, what that was your target? <sighs> really? Um, Rose, I'm no longer following the conversation. Aha! Uh -huh, you've got stub burnout. Oh no, is it contagious? What? what? Oh dear, mm -hmm. I think we've completely derailed. And, and whose, whose fault, fault is, is that? that? <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is like the I best. I finished preparing the bottles. I gotta find a save point first off. That's gonna be the issue. I need to find a save point, motherfuckers! Because once I find a save point, I can stop recording this fucking game. We're almost done. We're almost done with this game, hopefully. Like I said, this part, this game, the, this, the, the DLC is not that very long. 
All the answers you seek lie up ahead, in Camlon. Camlon. After the dragon fell, we all went to face the Lord of Calamity in our final battle. Which took place in Camlon. So Saray's path took him to Camlon, the Origin Village. Yep, that was also where the Hellionized Mautelis had been sealed away. What? Meaning that the ultimate causes of the Age of Chaos were there in Camlon. Your hunch wasn't too far off, Alicia. Of course, even if you'd made it there, you couldn't have gotten in anyway. Oh? Why is that? Cool your jets! We're explaining this in order! <sighs> Shots fired! Bitch! Can I go save it, please? This cave wasn't passable before, correct? God damn it! Let me fucking save! Camlon, then? Asshole! Through the sealed path from Elysia. Elysia? Saray's hometown? Yep. Bartlow had sent troops to invade the village, but... Oh, wait, you knew that part, didn't you? Yes. In the chaos, I missed the news of their deployment. Well, what happened was Kittybeard went and smashed Alicia's blessed domain, then lured them in. <sighs> oh, here we go again. It's all my fault. But it's true! What's done is done. Get over it. I'm not like you, Rose. Damn right you aren't. <laughs> I've never known anyone who could be so weak. Or so strong. Rose? Let's go, normal girl. Don't make fun of me. <laughs> I Unlikely. These two. <laughs> I love this! A comedic! <laughs> oh, thank you. It's nothing. It's nothing inevitably means it's something. Uh, I'm here if you need to get anything off your chest. I... I just don't know what to do with myself. I don't know if I want to live life as a princess, or a politician, or as a knight. Or if I want to throw off all those ties and just... just try to be a normal girl. Or if I want to live life as a squire. Purifying malevolence throughout the land. And you feel the need to find the answer to that, correct? Well, yes. I mean, I'm to be a stateswoman, serving my country and my people. I know this and accept it. And yet, life has never been so fulfilling as when I'm traveling together with all of you. I worry that I don't believe in my answer after all. To find one's answer... I agree that this is a very important thing. I told this to Saray and Rose as well. Exactly. That's why... Alicia, may I ask you this? Does gaining one's answer necessarily mean losing something else? Huh? That's all I can say for now. You spoil her too much. Sometimes we all need hints, Rose. You never gave us any hints. Maybe not, but this journey is soon to reach its end. We won't get to plod on and on in search of the answer like it was with you and Saray. True enough. My answer. This game, this game has been long enough, man. I've lost all the tensions. We're almost done with the game though, I'll tell you that much. We are almost done with the game. But I hope you guys have a nice positive day. We're gonna, I'm gonna go back and see if I missed anything. But yeah, I hope you guys have a nice positive day and TAKE FUCKING CARE BITCHES! We have to kill, we have to kill the motherfucker who's that guy, so yeah. I think we have like a two or maybe one or two more parts and then we're done with this fucking game. They fucking got!